Thank you, Kasichana, for that report. Elsewhere, as Kenya and China continue to collaborate in various sectors of development, embracing each other's cultures remain pivotal in bridging cultural gaps and creating a more cohesive working environment. While Kenyans joined Chinese living in Kenya to celebrate their mid-autumn festival, they reiterated the importance of participating in such a cultural celebrations to enhance not just their professional relationships, but also to foster mutual understanding and respect. In a vibrant display of cultural unity, Kenyans and Chinese nationals gathered at the Africa Star Railway Operation Company headquarters in Nairobi to celebrate the Mid Autumn Festival, a tradition deeply rooted in Chinese culture. This festive occasion served as more than just a cultural exchange. It highlighted the growing synergy between the two communities now working closely in Kenya's railway sector and other areas of the economy. Denis Odiambo, a University of Nairobi student pursuing Chinese studies, expressed that the festival provided him with invaluable first-hand experience, complementing his academic learning with real-world cultural immersion. Since I'm studying Chinese, this is a, this is a, it's a way that in such, in such a festival when I come, I get to learn more about their culture. His sentiments were shared by Wang Xinyu, a Chinese teacher at the Confucius Institute at the University of Nairobi, who emphasized the educational benefits and cultural value this event brings to students and locals alike. We come here to teach students Chinese. We also want students to learn the culture. It's good for their future job. Uh, they can join the uh, they can they can find a Chinese Chinese company. Nelson Asienoa of Africa Star underscored the festival's significance in strengthening the bond between Kenyans and Chinese people. The reason why we are celebrating with them is because Africa uh, uh, comprises of the Chinese expatriates and uh, the Kenyan expatriates. And through uh, the collaboration of these two, uh, uh, two communities, we find that we have to integrate the cultures together. And through the cultural integration, that's when we can uh, understand each other and you know, collaborate each other at work. Polina Simu for Lunchtime News.